Hello guys, welcome back to Ventilate, and here we are, another day, another game, and we are in good spirits, guys. We're very, very close to our next monument. Uh, i got 10 hours left. I should be able to hit it with the new monument. Once with the new monument, I should be able to hit up the levels and beat these big boys over here. So, just to show you a quick run. Um, guys, I know some of you asked for tips and tricks, and it's quite hard to kind of give you tips and tricks if you don't really have anything specific to ask about because i mean it's in, in almost every aspect of the game there is always tips and tricks on how you play with it right and so if i can give you say for example a general rule and when it comes to relics you want to be able to max out your book of shadows straight away and then use whatever the rest of it to be able to max out the rest with 25 percent or sorry with five percent but if you're gonna use a chest while you're doing it you're gonna go max it out use chest 25% on book of shadows and 5% on the rest so that's kind of um, some of the tips and tricks on how you can level up uh, more evenly and, and probably the most efficient of uh, ways of actually leveling up so yeah guys look I, I'm not exactly sure when you say tips and tricks because there's so many different things like for example tournaments one of the biggest tips you can have is don't join in the first two three hours if you are going to join in the first two three hours you're probably going to have a lot of competition you want to find a sweet spot uh, a few hours in or 10 hours in or 18 hours in before you join tournaments which is something that i did i usually join tournaments quite late i don't join it too early uh, i'm at my max stage again prestige now i got e016 so about 16e which is not too bad um, I'm gonna get that up to eight and to be able to get the next thing so yeah that, that's a little bit of tips and tricks and obviously when it comes to that uh, the global event I'm at say 44.78 at 3478 today um, I hit this um, every day without a miss of anything I join my clan raids all the time making sure my clan raids are ready to go and I'm hitting them as soon as I can so yeah guys i think that's all you can kind of do and obviously make sure you turn on your fairies at game fairy on but when you have had all your fairies and your diamonds turn it back off the reason is so that you don't get hassled by it as you're farming as you can tell the daily diamond fairies you want to get that because it gives you 10 fire stones each so that's kind of my tips and tricks and guys look abyssal tournament is on its way we only have about 26 hours left, 28 hours left before it happens. So that's going to be very, very exciting. And I love that. And this time around, the Bissell Tournament, what do we have? Ooh, this is new Golden Barrage. I don't think I've seen this one. Okay, guys, I'm, I'm going to look forward to this. This is going to be fun. Something we've never seen before, never had before. Golden Barrage. Am I losing it? I don't think I'm losing it. I don't think we've ever had a Golden Barrage Abyssal Tournament. But anyways, guys, that's going to be fun. It's going to be interesting. So basically, Golden Barrage, Golden Gun, you can put two and two together. That's probably going to be the uh, ultimate thing to use when it comes to this particular tournament. Alrighty, guys, um, that is going to be all for me. Thank you all for subscribing. Thank you for all, um, all of you that actually like the video and watch my videos. It really helps it go a long way. And I hope to continue to bring um, consistent content on this so that you don't get, you know, sort of sidetracked. But like, oh, no, he's only making it for a while. No, this is going to be consistent. I'm going to keep pumping out every tournament, uh, kind of keeping up to date of what's going on. And like I said, guys, I'm not going to make it to the top 100. Like, but I will try and see how far I can get as this is my first actual transcendence uh, obviously you're gonna gain a lot more momentum after the first transcendence the second one and so forth and yada 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 because just equipment alone you're gonna be a whole lot higher than um, than other people um, and so those are going to be the deciding factor and so i think the only way to do is to keep grinding and keep pushing your top level so since this is the first time i've done it um, i can't wait to try the next transcendence next time but until then I'm going to keep pushing and see how hard I can go with this. Okay, guys. Thank you all very much for everything. I'll catch you all later. Bye-bye.